All right, guys. So I'm gonna be teaching you how to reduce your system storage on your iPhone. Now, this is not no fluke video. There's a lot of false information out there, so I wanna be a, as accurate as possible. Note that there might be other ways to do this. So this is just the way I found out how to do it. Now, when you delete your photos, first off, um, should be a, a screenshot of everything that I'm doing on my phone right here. So. First off, when you delete your photos off your phone, it doesn't actually get deleted. It goes to your deleted um, section of your photo album. So go to albums where in your photos app, and then you scroll down and you see recently deleted. And when you clear your photos, they essentially don't really get deleted. They get into this recently deleted section. This is where you wanna delete most of your, or all of them, just delete all of them. And this will dramatically um, reduce the size of your system storage. Also, delete a lot of of your rarely used apps. The reason being is because these, when when system storage calculates how much storage you have, it takes some of the data from your those apps and puts them into system storage, and that can really increase your system storage too. So delete very unused apps like. I used to have Shazam and I thought, hey, you know, I use it sometimes, so put it in there, right? But I rarely open it or use it at all, so I deleted it. And though I will find a reason to download it again one day, I don't really need to have it on my phone. So delete unused apps that you don't really use at all. Use Just keep the most important apps on your phone, um, your most used apps, obviously. And then you're going to delete your most recently deleted photos, delete all of them. Um, keep this, keep your photos low. Also what you can do too is go to settings and go to photos. Once you go to photos in your settings, let me scroll right here to photos. If you go to optimize iPhone storage right here, this will also it will store your photos in iCloud from what I know and when it does that it when you actually need the photos it will download them on your phone like instantly so you can get access to it but they, they don't stay in your phone from what I remember so that helps with your system storage too I keep it off honestly I don't really want to put it in my cloud but there you go but that is a way to do that and that's it. I hope this helps. And comment below. Tell me if this helped you. Um, tell me if there's any other ways that you can decrease the system storage. Because that would help any everybody who watches this video. And they can look at the comments. Alright guys. Peace.